So the ATF has dropped the hammer today. I'm gonna get you up to date and some of y'all really, really need to hear this. All right, hey guys, as always a big good you chew to each of y'all. Not good, not good at all. A lot of folks are talking about this over the last two or three hours. I'm gonna get you up to date. Some of y'all may need to contact legal representation or at least make a phone call and at least get this process of conversation started. It's not good. I'm gonna read you a little bit of the email that came out today or the open letter that the AFT sent out today. It's a bunch of bull hockey and none of it is good. So buckle up. Unfortunately, here we go. Hey, this big bunch of fun is brought to you by my friends over at CMMG. Been doing giveaways all week long. I've, this is the last, this is the last of this shipment that I got a couple months ago. CMMG has the zeroed line. I got one more of each. I've got the 556 muzzle brake and the pistol grip and they're up for grabs. You know the drill, just let me know right down below. I will let you know in the comment section if you win. That's it, just make a comment down there and say, hey, I, I would like that. The zeroed line is fantastic. Check it out, you know how to find those people. Big thank you to CMMG for all the support here. Got two more. Now, I think that's the end of all the goodies for now. So thank you to those folks and to each of y'all. You know what I'm going to say? Every thumbs up is awesome. Thank you. Spicy Friday is tomorrow. I've got another giveaway tomorrow. I'm giving away five things tomorrow. Should be fun as well. I love giving stuff away. I always handle the shipping. I always handle just making it happen because I love getting stuff in the mail and I have sent out hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of things here. I just, I enjoy it. I really do. That's tomorrow. All righty, here we go. I'm going to be reading directly from my email account for in, in a second. Today, this happened, this happened at, let me see, 106 p.m. East Coast time, the AFT sent out an open letter. Now we're talking about those FRTs, the forced reset triggers, and this email went out to all FFLs. I got one and because I have a, a Curio and Relics license, and that's for all the meal syrup nonsense that I like. Again, some of y'all need to know this because this does affect some of y'all forced reset triggers. They were being examined and re-examined, and then the AFT, at some point in the last couple months, they changed the definition of what a machine G is, and here is what they had to say. This is directly from their email, an open letter to all federal firearm licensees. The Bureau of ATF, AFT, has recently examined devices commonly known as forced reset triggers, FRTs, and has determined that some of them are firearms and machine guns. Pause. They are saying that the trigger itself, this is asinine, that the trigger itself is a machine gun. That's literally what they are saying. As defined in the National Firearms Act, the NFA, and Machine Guns is Divided in the Gun Control Act, the GCA. These particular FRTs are being marketed as replacement triggers. And then they go forward, they start explaining what they're looking at and then they start explaining the consequences of owning these, selling these, possessing these, and they are deadly serious. They are coming after them starting today. Now, keep in mind, they changed the definition of machine guns. Jared has covered this. Is it, is it what they did? This is me speculating, or, or I can't remember. I think it's from pull to function. I think that's the word they do. One pull, pow versus one function. And that's one of the things when they sent that letter to all law enforcement, Jared has covered all that. All right, here's what happens and the consequences of owning that one little piece of metal. Failure to comply is a $10,000 per one violation and up to 10 years in federal prison. That aside, possession or transfer for an individual ten, up to 10 years, 250 k unless you're an organization and then, then it's half a million. And a lot of these are organizations, trusts and those sorts of things. And that's for sellers and possessors, those that are transferring and none of it is good. They are demanding, they even have in there, in the letter, they're saying that you need to turn yourself in, you need to holler at our field office, you need to start your compliance now. My recommendation, I am not a lawyer and I don't play one on TV, if you own one of these, I would start the process of conversating and, and, and protecting your rear end. 
and I think that's good advice. Jared said the same thing about an hour ago on his channel. I don't know this. I suspect lawsuits will be dropping ASAP. Again, I don't know that, but I think folks are going to go after, uh, I, I think, I think, yeah, I think the lawsuits are coming at the AFT. None of this is good. This is the White House's, uh, where they currently are. We have unelected officials making potentially you instantly into a felon. Instantly. Unelected officials from the non-legislative branch making up rules that make you a felon, and none of this is good. I know part of what we do here on YouTube is all the outrage, and I'm so mad, and, you know, it's not good. They dropped the hammer today. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. I think the next 36 hours, maybe even next week, should be super interesting. Going to be watching that one. What say you? Let me know right down below. To anyone that's against us for owning whatever we want from our collective cold dead hands. Bye.